Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the higher, everybody. Praise the higher. One more time. Praise the higher from whom all blessings flow. Amen, amen. This is your sister Karian in your side of Christ, your side of the Messiah, your side of Nazareth. If you want to know why, I call God the higher in the building called Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Messiah. I've done a video concerning that one. Greetings. Greetings to the 12 scattered tribe of Yashahel. Yashahel is the name given to Jacob. Jacob's name was not changed to Israel. The proper name is Yashahel. So I greet all the Hebrew Yashahelites scattered to the four corners of the earth all over in the diaspora. I greet you all in the matchless name of our soon coming King, Yeshua the Christ. And to the beautiful body of Christ, the church, who oh, great King is coming back forward without spot, wrinkle, or blemish. I greet you all in his glorious name, Yeshua the Christ. All right. You can skip this bit and find the main message. I am going to do some housekeeping. Remember my name, Sister Carrie Ann. It is in solid gray border with a tick by the side of my name. Anybody else pretending to be me is a wicked, dirty devil. You need to rebuke and report them. Please watch the video to the end. There's a sinner's pride there for you. We want you into the kingdom of Ohio. Thank you for liking the videos. Thank you for watching the videos. Thank you for sharing the videos. Thank you for going in the comment section and communicating with brothers and sisters. I really, really appreciate it. May Ahaya eternally bless you. Hallelujah. And thank you for those of you who have blessed me through PayPal and also on this platform. Um, thank you so, 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 so much. Amen, brothers and sisters. And Ahaya bless your families as well. Okay. All right. We are near, we're not only near, yes, brothers and sisters, we are near. We're not only near to the returning of the marvelous, glorious, beautiful, majestic Messiah, Yesiah the Christ, but we're also near to the revealing of the lawless one, the dirty Antichrist, brothers and sisters. I'm telling you that beast is coming. Daniel 7 verse 25 tells us that, tells us that Satan is going to change times, laws and seasons, and it will be done through the Antichrist. So this world will be relentless, demonic, it will be lawless. No Holy Spirit, no Haya, no Yesiah, just total Satanism running the earth red for a very short period of time. Yesiah says, pray to be found worthy to escape the things coming upon the earth. I believe the worthiness Yesiah is talking about is the woman. The woman in Revelation 12. The woman in Revelation 12 represents the second exodus. That is who she represents. Yes, we had a first exodus in ancient Hebrew, Yeshua's time, in Moses' time. But a higher promise is second exodus. And why is he doing the second exodus? Because number one, yes, it's for the true biblical church. He's going to hide some of, some, some of the brothers and sisters. But also it is for the Hebrew Yeshua'ites uh, that went through the transatlantic slavery and scattered throughout the four corners of the earth. A high is going to regather his people. It is going to happen. That's what the woman in Revelation 12 represents. Really, it's a second exodus. All right. Um, so that is going to happen. So after the second exodus, then Ahaya, then, <coughs> sorry, then the sixth seal opened. That is when Yesiah comes in the clouds of glory. So second exodus first and then the sixth seal. All right. All right. Okay. We have a prophetic theme song called We Are Near. It's a song that my mommy taught me when I was a little girl. She used to hide sweeties and toys and we were near to the stuff. She used to sing a song called How Near You Are and Truly We Are Near. And the song goes like this. Fitting song for, song for these end times because we're truly near and the song goes like this. How near you are, oh near you are, oh near you are, oh sing a song with the right confidence right give me one second brothers and sisters i'm just going to open up the window i'll be back in a second all right i leave the camera rolling i'm in the kitchen and it is super warm it is so warm Ugh. right hallelujah glory be to the most sky bless the lord all right sorry brothers and sisters all right so yes just open up the window a little bit i'm just super super duper 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 in the kitchen you see all right, brothers and sisters, hallelujah, glory be to the most time. All right, we have two ministries, one for the end time prophetic ministries and one for the Hebrew Yashahelites, all right, the Hebrew Yashahelites. Um, so this is our end time prophetic ministry I'm going to give. Listen, brothers and sisters, I've been getting, because remember, I'm, I don't live in Babylon, U.S., 
I don't follow celebrity news or any news of any matter. So, <coughs> couple brothers and sisters have been sending me email concerning Jamie Fox. Yeah, why am I doing videos about Jamie Fox? I'll tell you the reason why. Uh, the main reason I'm doing videos about these celebrities, brothers and sisters, because I do not want the church to go into deception. That's that's all it is. My people perish for a lack of knowledge. And when Ahaya is talking about lack of knowledge, it's not only lack of knowledge in Christ, the Yesai, Christ, the Messiah, Yesiah, amen, but it's lack of knowledge in spiritual things. You don't want to be praying for a reptilian in human form, basically, all right? So I do videos about these celebrities to warn the church, okay? So, two months ago, I did a video <coughs> when the whole thing came out that Jamie Foxx was hospitalized. I will leave the, I'll leave the playlist of Jamie Foxx. You need to watch it, all right? When he just went into hospital, news broke, brothers and sisters, sent me a message, Sister Karen, Jamie Foxx is in hospital. Straight away in my spirit, I knew that this was going to be a situation of Damar Hamlin. We all remember Damar Hamlin, because we know that the real one is unalive, and there's a clone walking around claiming to be Damar, all right? So I said to myself straight away, the Holy Spirit showed me that this is a Damar situation. I came on you, you. And I did a video two months ago when Jamie... Uh, was hospitalized and I say to brothers and sisters pay attention because when the Jamie comes out of hospital really really pay attention to him because it's not going to be him I was very strong in saying that all right I was very very strong in so just listen to this so this is a video I did two months ago this was when oh come on okay. so I did this video 25th of April 2023 25th of April 2023 um, so listen to what I say here because this is very 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 important brothers and sisters sorry um, I do apologize to to these adverts are getting to my alert all right um hold on one second brother hold on one second brothers and sisters I really thought I was recording I've been talking for the last five minutes <laughs> didn't realize that i press the pause button devil is a liar so i wanted to show you this video brothers and sisters all right i wanted to show you this video that i did two months ago i did this video two months ago in two, well, nearly three months in april when the news broke like i said when jamie fox they said that jamie fox was sick and straight away my spirit eye showed me that it's the same similar situation to Damar. I began to prophesy in the video and I said to brothers and sisters with passion, I said this with passion, I'm going to play it for you. When Jamie Foxx comes out of the hospital, we know it's not going to be him, that you need to pay attention because he's going to be super different and it's not going to be him. Listen to what I say. This video was done April 2023, 25th of April 2023. Listen. Because the way how to talk about it, the way how... The news, well, when I read it, really, when the article came in, in my, in my, in my um, email, and when I read it, the way I thought exactly what then. Um, so, we need to watch. So, when he comes back, sorry, Jamie, when he comes back, we need to really look at him to see if it is. The real Jamie Fox. Being serious, brothers and sisters. This devil, this is spiritual wickedness in high places we're dealing with. I told you when you lie in bed with Satan, he's got authority over you. He can do anything that he wants. Because you don't have the, the full protection. So I did that video because in my spirit something was desperately wrong. And I didn't want the church to be deceived. I didn't want you to be praying for a clone. I didn't want you to be praying for a fallen angel. Who was taken over well, who was shape shifted in human form. So I said that vision, I said that prophecy with a passion. You have to watch when he comes out and see what's going on. So 
brothers and sisters been sending me email I had about I've got about four or five email and this is why I'm doing the video because I can't um, I can't ignore this one they've been sending me emails brothers and sisters um, concerning Jamie Fox giving an update so this is a so-called Jamie Fox that did a video a couple days ago all right so this is him I just don't want you to see me like that man you know I want you to see me laughing having a good time partying Cracking a joke, doing a movie, television show. I didn't want you to see me with uh, with tubes um, running out of me and and trying to figure out uh, if if I was gonna make it through. And to be honest with you, my uh... right. So they say that this is the original Jamie Fox. When this video came in, brothers and sisters, when the when beloved sent me this video, as I said, I got three or four of the same video. When it came in to me, I'm telling you the first thing that caught my eyes was his eyes. Who is this person? Because I'm telling you, brothers and sisters, the eyes... It's the same similar situation to Damar Hamlin. Remember Damar Hamlin in the hospital bed? <laughs> With both of his parents by his side. And you look in Damar Hamlin's eyes and there was nothing there. That, that was an entity. And this video that came in for, for Jay, from Jamie. Well, they said it's Jamie. It's not really Jamie, really and truly. Brothers and sisters, the eyes. Listen, I'll show it to you. Those are dead eyes. Sorry, brothers and sisters. Those eyes are dead eyes, brothers and sisters. I am telling you, this, this is an entity. This is not Jamie Foxx. I refuse to believe. You might have said, oh, Sister Karen, but remember, just like Damar, he was sick. Remember, Jamie was very, very sick, near to death and all this. So, you know, I might lose a bit of weight and stuff like that. But even so, brothers and sisters, I am telling you, even so, right? The eyes is just, oh gosh, I'm looking at it and I have to be careful. I'm telling you, it's the eyes. It's the eyes for me, brothers and sisters. This, These are not, these are not human eyes. I'm, I'm telling you, dark. That's not Jamie. I believe this is an entity. And I, you see, I cannot lie. I'm so glad I did that video as a point of reference. Warning brothers and sisters, when he comes out of the hospital, they need to take a serious look at him. Not just look and turn their eyes away. Two separate different people in this photograph, brothers and sisters. That's the real... Fox, that's an imposter. So the plain damage control, isn't it? The wicked. The wicked is plain damage. Look at the eyes. You're going to tell me that the, those two eyes are the same. It's not. You have to wake up, church. You have to wake up, right? Imposter. So you're going to tell me, because I've done videos about this, when brothers and sisters sent me sent me a couple of videos. First video I got is Sister Carrie and look, Fox is out of the hospital. He's on a boat in Chicago on a river, waving his hands and doing the peace sign. All right. It didn't come out and say anything. Then somebody sent me another video with him on, I don't know where it was, but we were playing golf. Still didn't come out and say anything. Then somebody sent me another video with him going in a car, handing somebody, some woman his purse. Some woman her purse because she dropped her purse or something. He still didn't do any video and come out. So why do a video now at this late stage? You might as well just walk around, do you think? Why do a video at this late stage and coming out, right? <laughs> coming out and saying that, you know, you didn't want to come out and talk to anybody because you didn't want to see anybody. You didn't want people to see you in hospital tubes and um, you wanted everybody to see you laughing and smiling and cracking a joke. It doesn't work like that. 
why wait because the wicked is under pressure because people are catching up so what they quickly shape shift one of these entities is reptilian because they can shape shift and expect you see the problem with the shape shift and the problem the problem with the fallen angels is that yes they they can shape shift into a human or to somebody that they choose to but they never get it exactly the same they can't they can't and it makes me think <coughs> why ahaya hid the body of moses really really makes me think why ahaya hid the body of moses right the last video i did concerning jamie fox is that he's incapacitated wherever he is is incapacitated which means that yeah he's not in a good place the real one i'm talking the real authentic one right so <coughs> sorry brothers and sisters so when i did that video i did it out of love to warn brothers and sisters because the last thing i want you to do is to fall on your knees go into fasting pulling yesiah off the cross heal jamie fox father when the, when they're popping up and down the place when the when this entity pretending to be jamie is popping up and down the place and it's not him this this video brothers and sisters this is not him and i'll be honest with you my uh my sister Deidre Dixon, my daughter corinne listen Marie, saved my life so uh to them to god to a lot of great medical people uh i'm able to leave you this mm -mm. Um, i'm telling you this is this is this, this is this is not this is not the real fox this this i believe this is an entity Bible said test the spirit try the spirit and see whether they're of the most die or not the eyes i'm telling you brothers and sisters them eyes the eyes i'm telling you them eyes give the give like I say, brothers and sisters, like I say, the fallen angel can shape shift. They can, but they never ever get it exactly the same. They can't. They can't. They never ever ever. How is that similar? How is that picture the same? <laughs> How is it the same? Com no, completely different people, brothers and sisters. I'm telling you completely it's, it's, a, it's an entity it's a fallen angel the prevalent now you got one kanye yeah ye walking up and down <clears throat> with his so-called wife need to do a video on that woman as well what the lord showed me about her oh my god um that's not that's not the real e ye, ye, ye or kanye it's not him but these people are taking a mockery they take everything for sure and they're mocking. That's all they're doing, brothers and sisters. They are mocking, I'm telling you. But Ahaya cannot lie. Ahaya never ever lies. And we are children of the light. We are not children of the darkness. And so therefore, we're always in the light. And Ahaya will not allow us to be deceived. And he cannot be mocked either. He cannot be mocked. And like I say, I know I'm repeating myself. Why wait so long? If this is the real Jamie Fox, why wait? When did he go on the boat? About when did I do that video? About three weeks ago. He went on the boat in Chicago. Then he went and playing golf. Then he went. Then he handed somebody's purse. And I think I did another video. Oh, it's not on this phone. I don't think it's on this one. I think I did another video of him. That he just looked completely different, right? Why wait so long? Because the, truly the first thing you, you should have done, if it's a real one, the first thing you should have done is to come out and do a little press conference or do a little proper, um, you see, they, so, <laughs> the falling, is, you remember that interview with Damar, he was glitching like mad. The, the amount of time they cut that video. The splice it, the slice it, the dice it. Because the, the entity inside of Damar was glitching. He was, he was shape-shifting. Couldn't hold his form. 
and so i believe that the entity this fallen angel didn't do because they don't want what happened to damar to happen you know to be showed up on on tv if they do a proper interview so they get the entity behind the camera because the camera probably have filters heavy 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 filters that you can't even see when he's glitching and he just do it by himself rather than go doing a proper proper interview that's a fallen angel that's that that's a shapeshifter because they can they can shapeshift i do believe that the real i do believe that the real authentic jb fox is very very ill like incapacitated really ill but they're doing damage control but a high is going to blow the lid of all these things and those brothers and sisters who don't believe in falling angel shape-shifting it's basically cloning shape-shifting into celebrities or whatever whatever it may be it is real it is real brothers and sisters i'm telling you sad really really sad but when you uh, put Yesaya to one side for fame and fortune and you only pick him up as and when, you only talk about him as and when or when you feel like it, you mention his name, that is not good. What it is to gain, what is it for a man to gain the whole entire world and lose his soul? Why? What is it? Because it's, it's not worth it. Brothers and sisters, we're living in serious time. You have to pay attention. You have to be on your cue, on your pews. Do not be deceived. Like I say, Yesaya says, Ahaya says that um, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. When you do not have knowledge, not only in Yesaya the Christ, but when you don't have knowledge in the things that's going on around you. If you cannot discern the times and the seasons that we're in. You know, Yesaya says in the, in the particular scriptures, it says that he, hypocrites, he can discern the times. Um, like, I'm paraphrasing, like he says, he, you know, he... You are hypocrites. Some of you are hypocrites because you can discern when the rain is going to fall, when the sun is going to shine, but you cannot discern um, when the son of man is going to put in his appearance. Because they choose not to. Shape shifting is real and it, and it is getting very, very prominent now. Very, 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 very. It's in your face. Why is it so prominent? Because it's lawlessness. Because the church is living in a state where... The, the church has really and truly the power that's supposed to be in the church, in the body of Christ, to subdue. The Bible says that greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. Now, if we're operating and we don't have that, um, that, that power, that resurrection power inside of us, you can't overcome the world. Satan is going to laugh at you. So you have to wise up. Well, you have to, what time is it? You have to wise up and understand the times and the seasons. Brothers and sisters, we're living in. But please watch my full playlist on Jamie Foxx. Haya gave me a playlist on him. Um, I'm about to finish now, but listen to me. That, this is an entity. Oh. Furthermore, let me go back to the video quickly. That's an video. entity, brothers and sisters. I I'm tell telling you. Really you. To have no, that's your that's. Family kick in in such no, a way, and, no. and y'all know they kept it airtight. They didn't let nothing out. They protected me, and that's what I. That that that's not the real one. I'm telling you. Something is it? Something is. Yeah, you have to understand. What is going on? You have to understand the times and the season. But the person sent me this video. I don't know who's done it. But it's not my video. But somebody has sent it to me. Probably got it from somebody else's channel. And sent it to me. But. Oh. 
brothers and sisters, that we have to wake up. Spiritual wickedness in, in high places. This is what we're fighting. This is what we're fighting. Spiritual wickedness in high, in high places. <laughs> All right. Um, our reading flow for comments underneath some of these videos. <laughs> and some of the people were saying, uh, hang on. Uh, they were saying, look at this Jamie. They said, look at this Jamie Fox. He looks like he's lost weight. Um, his eyes are drooping. He looks really, really ill. He looks really, really sick. But when he's on the boat, he looks buffed up, something like that. Or when he's, you know, going in, when he was going in the car and handing the lady her purse, it looks really big and thick. So how comes it just looks small? <laughs> because it's a clone. It's not the real one. Sad. Sad, really. And they're doing it to our black people, ain't it? Hmm. And there's going to be a lot of black people that's going to be cloned, and unfortunate brothers and sisters. I'm telling you, these people are, they're, anyways, anyways, look, we come to the end of the video. They have not accepted the Messiah as Lord and Savior. Please say this in a prayer after me. The Messiah, the Christ, I know that you're the son of Ahia, whom the world calls God. I believe that Messiah died on the cross for my sins, Messiah. I thank you for dying for me and I believe in your death, burial, resurrection and that Ahaya has raised you from the dead. I know with confidence that you are the son of Ahaya, Yesiah, king of glory. I come before you right now and I'm asking you to wash away all my sins and to forgive me for all that I've done wrong. I repent for my wicked ways, Ahaya. I thank you for your beautiful son, Yesiah, and I pray that you'll help me to live a life of repentance and give up the things that spread into you in this world. Thank you for salvation. And for saving me. If you said that prior, you believe with your heart, welcome to the body of Christ. We believe in Acts chapter 2, verse 38. When the Bible talks about repentance, you've done that. You now need to find a man of the most die, ask him to fully baptize you, fully dunk you in water. When you go down in water, you're saying that your side died on the cross. You believe in the atonement of sin. When the man of the most die raised you out of the water, you're raised into new life. You are raised into the glory and the power of Christ, resurrection, beautiful stuff. So be bold, be strong, be courageous. Walk with Ahaya just like Enoch and have a mindset of Job, all praises, all beautiful praises to the most star, Ahaya, who lives above the heavens. Ahaya, eternally bless you. I love you all. And I will see you soon, someday in glory. In your size, holy name. Amen. Amen. They say the benediction. Benediction is Jude chapter 1. Jude chapter 1, verses 24 to 25. The Bible reads, Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you forth less before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise Isaiah, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Amen and amen. Amen blessings. Amen.